Hello, this is the Cyber Road Time, and welcome to Pokemon Data Emerald Part 2. Let's get into this. Pokemon on the Route 1, no, 3 must include. Oh, hi, Cyber. Oh, I see my dad gave you a Pokemon as a gift. Since we're here, let's have a quick battle. I'll give you a taste of what being a trainer is like. <laughs> Friends only. Oh, I have the story for today's episode. As I said, friend zone. Also, I'm going to die. So the story is yes. this girl, nameless Quinn. I liked her ever since like fifth grade, right? And in that fifth grade, like halfway through the school year, I asked her out, and she friend zoned me. And I'm still mad about that to this day. Whenever it's brought up, I don't want to hear her name. It makes me salty. It makes me saltier than a whole freaking cracker. So that was the story. That's all the story is. Mother, I would like to fry that. I think I know why my dad has an eye out for you now. I mean, you just got that Pokemon, but it really likes you. You might be able to befriend any Pokemon easily. Well, it's time to head back to the lab. Cyber over here! Let's hurry home. Okay, May. What was your name, July? Yeah, your name was July. Okay, July. God. Let's go in. Oh, hi, Cyber. I heard you beat May on your first try. That's excellent. May's been helping with my research for a long time. May has an ex extensive history of a trainer already. Here, Cyber, I ordered this for my research, but I think you should have this Pokéax. Cyber received the Pokéax. The Pokéax is a high-tech tool that automatically makes a record of any Pokémon you meet or catch. My kid, May, goes everywhere with it. Whenever my kid catches a rare Pokémon and records its data in the Pokéax, she hasn't even caught a Pokémon. Not even a rare one, act <laughs> that. Like... Trico is a rare Pokemon because it's a starter, but like still, and records and records its data in the Pokedex. Why? May looks for me while I'm out doing field work and shows me. Oh well, Cyber, you got a Pokedex too. That's great. Just like me, I've got something for you too. Why is this girl giving me her balls? It's fine if you can get a lot of Pokemon. I'm going to go all over the place because I want so many different Pokemon. If I find cute Pokemon, I'll catch them with Pokeballs. Okay. Wait, Cyber! Cyber, Cyber! Did you introduce yourself to Professor Birch? Oh, what an adorable Pokemon. You got it from Professor Birch. How nice. You're your father's child, all right? You look good together with the Pokemon. Here, honey, if you're going out on an adventure, wear these running shoes. You'll put a zip in your step. Cyber, those shoes came with the instructions. I don't care. I don't care. Why, why are all these words I don't care? How do I read this? I'm just gonna throw it at you. Think that you have your own Pokemon now. Your father will be overjoyed. But please be careful. If anything happens, you can come home. Go on, get the money. I was trying to add in why did you throw this instruction booklet at me, but I couldn't. <laughs> I didn't feel like it. Let's go heal.
Now it's a shopping spree. How many Poke Girls do I have? 10? How many potions? 1. Okay, let's get 9 potions. So I can have the same amount, which I always like to have. Now let's go to the next route. Yeah, I'm official Pokemon trainer, but I'm better than you. Ziggy again. Okay, well that's a mud kiss. Water gun. Mudkip, use water gun. You can do this. Use water gun again. Oh, come on. Mudkip, use water gun. Zigzagoon fainted. Mudkip gained 97 EXP. Mudkip grew to level 8. Mr. Kelvin sent out for Dove. Oh, a Gen 5 Pokemon. Gen 5's. Well, let me change this up a bit. Gen 4 is best gen, but Unova is my favorite region because it's my home. Oh my. Why does this battle have to be annoying? It's my first battle in this game. And I don't have any items, so. Just gonna speed up the game. Get up, Vincent. Mudkip is level 9. Mudkip's trying to learn Foresight. Stop learning Foresight. A Bartleby? Let's talk about my opinions on the reasons. Kanto! I'm not a Gen 1 it's just okay. I could go without it, definitely. Johto. I love Johto. It's the closest thing that we have to open worlds until Legend Arceus. Hoenn, 7.8 out of 10. I don't like that amount of water. It's kind of a really big amount of water. Now Sinnoh, 10 out of 10. I don't like the snow roots though. Piplop, amazing. Rotom, channel mascot. And then, all the added evolutions are brilliant, too. I could ramble on and on about Sinnoh. Unova, best region. It's based off of my home. Kalos. Kalos is another one of those okay ones. Alola? Alola, it's... I don't know how to describe Alola. It's kind of weird. It's in between, really. Like, if I have other options, I'd probably choose the other options, but Alola's pretty good. There aren't really that many good things about Alola, but put it all together, it's good. Yo, Zoralt! Catch this dude. Mudkip, tackle. Heal. A nice. That's a nice UI interface, or whatever it is. I don't remember the name. Oh, yo. Come on. <sighs> 
Wait, Galade's in this game. Yo. I think I had a fighting type. Hold down B. It's always good luck. Ralts was caught. Did the nickname to Ralts? No. A hop up tackle. I'm gonna speed it up and mute this. Hop up really just takes a while, doesn't it? And it's defeated. Now bide, no. Lollipop, I could take this out with like a water gun. Why do I need to switch? I don't remember that move. Round eyes? I don't remember that. Still, I don't remember round eyes being a move. Like, I really don't know that move. And that battle is done. And that's going to do it for this video. This has been the Cyber Rotom, and peace.